Hey y'all, this is Zach from Meals Under Pressure. Um, tonight we're going to be making a Korean beef recipe. Now we've made it several times between myself and uh, my camera woman's family there. Uh, really good recipe. Uh, it's pretty much a one dump, one pot recipe. Um, so let me kind of show you what you're going to need. Uh, I've got two pounds of ground beef here because we've got four or five people eating. Um, if it's just me and my wife, we'll only get a pound. But this is two pounds of, of ground beef. Yeah, I've was, got a was three and a half. Three yeah, and a half. Um, I got a medium-sized white onion. I'm gonna use about six cloves of garlic, applesauce, and unsweetened applesauce. One time I made the mistake of getting sweetened applesauce, and apparently I was wrong. So it's unsweetened applesauce, chili paste, soy sauce, a little bit of sesame oil, and some brown sugar. And um, I've got white pepper, not black pepper, ginger powder and then salt and pepper to taste. And then you can put whatever kind of toppings you want on it afterwards. Uh, I like to fry an egg, so I put a fried egg on top, uh, green onions, um, and carrots. and she likes carrots, mm -hmm. little, those little matchstick carrots. So I'm gonna get to dicing my garlic and my, uh, and my white onion, and we'll be back. All right, so I've got my, my onion diced up and my garlic, and I went ahead and put my hamburger meat in the Instant Pot. I'm gonna turn it on, the saute function. I'm gonna go ahead and put my, uh, my onions in there. I'm gonna cook my onions and my, my meat down at the same time. So this is gonna heat up and I'll basically just brown the meat um, and the onions will they'll soften with the meat and then I'll come back and I'll put my, uh, my garlic in at that point. So let's give it a few minutes to, uh, to brown and we'll be back. We're back, um, I've got my beef browned with my onions. That broke down real good. And now I'm gonna add my garlic. You don't wanna add the garlic in with the rest of the stuff because it burns quick. So I'm gonna put that in. Let's stir it in. And you don't wanna stir it long. Usually about 30 seconds, 45 seconds a minute. Usually I just judge it by about two sips of my beer. Just so you can start smelling. Salt function off. I'm gonna start adding my other stuff in. I've got three tablespoons of brown sugar. And you can use light or dark. I, I usually normally use uh, light brown sugar. Um, I've got a tablespoon and a half of ginger powder. That all stirred in together. Man, it's already got a good smell to it. I love that ginger powder. You what? Love that ginger powder. Yeah. Uh, a quarter teaspoon, I'm sorry, a quarter tablespoon of the, uh, the white pepper. All right, a teaspoon of chili paste. This gives it a nice little kick in the butt. How much want to use, Amy? Did it say cup? one tea? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I think it said one teaspoon. I mean, one, uh, yeah, one, one teaspoon. It's one teaspoon of sesame oil. This gives it just a whole other level of flavor that I like. Okay. Get that stirred in. And last but not least, we've got a half cup of unsweetened applesauce and a quarter cup of soy sauce. And salt and pepper to have your taste. You can always add more to if you want. Alright. Give it another good stir. Take your lid, make sure it's set to the sealed position. And hit the 
manual button or pressure cook button, whatever is on your model. I'm going to bring it down to four minutes. So, all right, we'll be back. We're going to cook the rice. I did fail to mention that we're going to put over white rice. Um, there, Jasmine. Uh, there are recipes where they cook the rice together using a trivet, and I just, to me, it's easier just to cook you know, the rice on, on the stove top. So, yes, we're going to cook our rice. Jasmine, mm -hmm. she likes jasmine. Mm -hmm. um, and that's what we'll use. We'll, we'll put the beef over the rice. So, all right, we'll be back. All right, so we cooked it for four minutes under pressure. I did a, a 10 minute natural release and then I flipped the switch. Uh, and here's what we got. You want to take a look at it? Mm -hmm. This stuff is really good. Don't worry about the juice in there because that's going over the fried, ri fried rice. That's going over the mm -hmm. jasmine. jasmine rice. Um, so here we got, now you don't have to top it with anything if you want, but I topped it with some carrot sticks or those little matchstick carrots. I fried an egg and I've got some green onions. And folks, this stuff is really good. This is like the third time we've made it between the, the two families. And you know, we've always, you know, just it's no leftovers. Yeah, mm -hmm. no leftovers. So really good Korean beef. Um, again, if you like my video, uh, I've got a Facebook page, Meals Under Pressure. I also got a YouTube channel and I post a lot of videos there. Um, a lot of chatting on the Facebook page. So you can go to either one of those and, and like and follow. Uh, but right now we're going to get to eating. So we'll see y'all next time.